everyone welcome to another system zones video in this video i am going to show how to configure microtik wi-fi ap with dhcv server to configure microtik wi-fi ap i am using microtik haplite wireless router which has four ethernet interfaces one wlan interface and microtik router wise with license level 4 what we will do in this video in this video at first we will reset microtik router OS default configuration because every router OS uh, comes with default configuration and sometimes default configuration makes confusion and then we will configure Wi-Fi AP on WLAN interface and then we will create a bridge interface and uh, we will add either 2 to either 4 interface and WLAN interface to this bridge and then we will do router wise basic configuration where we will assign one IP LAN gateway IP uh, default gateway IP, DNS IP and do netting configuration and then we will set up DSCP server on bridge interface so let's start it at first we will log in microtik router with winbox software and reset default configuration no default configuration and reset yes now resetting router OS and it will reboot and after rebooting we will get a fresh router OS Reconnect Yet not ready Fresh. Yeah So connect this is fresh router OS and there is no configuration so first we will create Wi-Fi AP so go to wireless and first we will create security profiles new security profile and put a profile name I am giving Wi-Fi profile and make sure mode is dynamic keys and authentication types will be WPA PSK and WPA2 PSK and now put WPA password and WPA2 password I am providing same password but if you want you can use different password now apply now go to Wi-Fi interfaces and by default Wi-Fi interface will be disabled so first enable it double click on WLAN interface and for Wi-Fi AP the mode will be AP Breeze and SSID I am providing Microtech AP also you can choose frequency now we will select uh, security profile for this click advanced mode and then security profile which will be 
Wi-Fi profile and make sure default authenticate and default forward is selected and then click apply okay now we will find our SSID is available and we can connect it with password it factors and it will be connected we'll find one wireless device has been registered but it will not get any IP address because yet we have not set up any IP so limited access so we will now set up IP with DHCP server at first we will go to breeze and create a breeze interface which is a virtual interface but layer 3 interface apply ok now we will add ether2 to ether4 interface and our wlan interface to this bridge so go to ports and new bridge port and choose ether2 and from lan bridge apply copy now ether 3 apply copy again now oh, reconnect okay copy now ether 4 apply copy again now wlan 1 interface apply Okay. Now, either two to either four, and WLAN interfaces are now uh, layer two interfaces. Okay. Now we will do basic configuration. So first we will assign one IP, which is. 92.168.2 provided by ISP and choose either one interface which is our one interface click apply now we will assign LAN gateway one LAN breeze interface okay now we will assign DNS IP I am providing Google public DNS now we will assign gateway default gateway and default gateway is 168.70.1 okay now our router OS is able to communicate with in internet okay now we will do netting configuration so go to firewall and then net and from general choose source net chain and optionally we can put LAN block and from action we will choose masquerade okay 
now we will set up DHCP server on bridge interface DHCP address space will be LAN block ok gateway 70.1 ok and the IP pool will be from 2.2.2.5.4 ok and DNS server default ok default list time is 10 minute uh, I am giving default but if you want you can change it as your demand now this CP setup successful ok now if we check we will find microtech ap has been connected and i have two connection one for ap and another for lan i am disconnecting lan and reconnect again with wi-fi and check the IP address no IP address has been given disconnect and connect again ok connect yes now we will check what is our IP and IP has been assigned 254 from DHCP server and we will find the IP from list here now if we check our internet either working or not from browser and it's ok so so my protic wifi ap configuration with dcv server has been completed this is for today thanks for watching this video if you have any query please put in comment and if you are a newcomer don't forget to subscribe to our channel bye bye